Y tratando, pero sí, hoy ya el tráfico ha estado de loco aquí hoy. Ay, ya me imagino. ¿Y usted cómo está? Bien, gracias a Dios, ahí cansada yo, ¿no? Ya no, ya siento que tiro a la toalla. <ríe> ¿Por qué? Ay, no sé, yo, yo ya dormí mi rato y no me duermo en la clase. Buenas noches. Epa, Oscar, buenas noches. Bueno. ¿Cómo me le va, Carlitos? Sandrita, ¿Qué tal, Oscar? Vino, vino. Bien, bien. Bien, bien, sí. aquí ya. Con ánimo. Ya con, con, ganas de, con ganas de terminar este volar. Ay, yo estaba Buenas en la noche. Pero fíjense bueno. que este, está, me están diciendo de que comenzaríamos el siguiente módulo, el 2. Sí, a mí me, ya me mandaron Hoy a me llamaron. los papeles ya. Exacto. Yo, no, yo voy en el otro, ya me quedé. Yo, yo le dije que no den una semana de de tiempo pues para que descansemos un poquito pues. a ver sí, qué dicen sí, ellos es muy pesado muy pesado sí, demasiado ahorita, 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 no. ahorita, ahorita, no. han, Oscar, ahorita han estado bastante mm -hmm. seguidos pero en el primer módulo recuerdo que se tardaron como casi 25 días para comenzar del segundo ah, ah, bueno. no sé sí. por qué ahora esta vez se, se han puesto bien ni siquiera ha terminado este y ya están solicitando los papeles. ¿no? Mejor, hombre, ah. si salimos más rápido. Ah. Teacher, good evening. Es, es ah, en bien, medio. Good evening. Ah, Cuando terminamos. Bien, en teacher. el medio coloquio. Ya estamos en escrito para el otro diplomado. ¿Y ya. este para cuándo les han dicho que comienza el siguiente? El 2. 2 de octubre. Sí. Y tenemos, hoy es 21, ¿verdad? Terminamos, cabal, cabal el lunes. Ah, no, o sea, 20. Que terminamos, 20. Hoy es 20. Miércoles terminamos, 20. Terminamos el viernes de la próxima semana y comenzamos el lunes no. de la siguiente. No, no, terminan el miércoles. El 27. De hoy a ocho días terminan. Ah. Bueno, hoy tenemos pero... las sesiones. Hoy tenemos son... la sesión, hoy tenemos la sesión 15. Sí. Nos faltan cinco. Ajá. Descansaría. Ah. No. Llevamos una semana. Menos. Miércoles, eh. jueves, viernes. Cae cinco días. Es que siempre, siempre la última semana les, les llaman y les preguntan si van a seguir el siguiente. Para, y ya les van pidiendo los requisitos. Siempre han hecho así. Siempre es una semana ah, antes. Okay. A mí ahora me llamaron y les dije que sí, pero no, no he tenido chance de ir a Recursos Humanos porque me han tenido sobresaturado. Ajá. Bueno, ayer no me pude conectar, salí bien tarde de trabajar. Ahora vine como a las 7. Pues yo, yo todavía voy a tener la documentación. Sí, está pesado aquí el tráfico. ¿eh? Sí, lo único que no les dije fue este, que se quede usted siempre como teacher de nosotros, teacher. Ay, yo cuando entré lo oí diciendo, me puse triste. No, para que, nada. Que dijo de que ya estaba, ya quería terminar este volado, digo. No, pues sí, te, para descansar un ratito. Ay, yo dije, ay, está, no, ya está no Está pesado. Quiere, no, para nada, tiche. Que sigue usted con nosotros. Nos ha tenido mucha paciencia. Sí, así es. Yo la felicito, Tiche. A ustedes también sí. yo lo felicito porque han sido buenos alumnos ustedes también. Bueno, gracias. Pero no se ponga así porque nos va a Los melancolismos <ríe> para la otra semana, Tiche. <ríe> Vamos a llorar antes del tiempo. Pero si ustedes todos dicen que sí, lo van a volver a dejar en el mismo. ¿Quién va a estar juntos? Siempre queda, siempre queda usted con nosotros. Yo no. voy con, yo desde no. que empecé he estado con Miguel y con Melba a llevar y Leticia y todo. Carlito. Ojalá que sigan todos, porque si no siguen todos, a veces se cierran los grupos, como si no hay otro, no hay de, otro del mismo nivel. Digamos, entonces no, no, no se abre el grupo porque no hay participantes. Entonces traten de ustedes de, bueno, yo no sé si todos van a seguir, ¿va? pero hagan el ánimo. Lo bueno sería que todos sigamos y, y aunque se sienta cansado, 
que ya bien próximo, pero realmente no sabemos qué va a pasar con Insafor. Así que hay que no, ver no, también si esa otra parte. El, el no por eso, pero... No. Piche, pásenos mm. el dato ahí. Pásenos el dato. Mm. Por favor. Va a haber una gran reducción, entonces muy probablemente que hay muchos programas que ya no van a ser cubiertos. De los que de los de los aprovechemos. Es sí, igual que de aprovechar, de aprovechar. Bueno, según anunciaron que en vez de reducirse, bueno, eso es lo que dijeron, va. Yo a mí no me crean. Este, se iba a mejorar, dijeron. Se iba a mejorar, se iba a ampliar. Porque es parte de las tío. porque es parte de las del sexto, de la sexta, ¿cómo le llaman? El sexto paso del ah, del ¿cómo se llama? del plan. Ajá. Es el parte, que... entonces el ampliar que... Eh, oportunidades para jóvenes, eh, oportunidades de cursos y, y de carreras así como técnicas, como lo que ofrece en Safor. Entonces él dijo que iba a ampliarlo. Entonces en esa esperanza estamos, ¿verdad? Que en vez de, se, de que se quiten, se, se mejoren. Entonces en Ay. esto ya, ya se sabría, ya se sabría si ustedes no seguirían. Y imagínense, ya lo llamaron con más razón, con mayor razón. No, lo que pasa es que todavía no ha sido aprobado el, el, la creación del, o sea, está en proyecto, media vez entre a, a trabajar ya el, el otro instituto, ahí sí van a cambiar las cosas, así que mejor aproveche pues Hay ahorita que y, sí, y esperemos lo que venga después. Aprovechen. Ah, pues ya me convenció, Tich. <ríe> Miren, este, estos cursos sí es pesado porque eh, son dos horas diarias, pero díganme una cosa, qué cosa que valga, que no valga la pena, no cuesta. O sea, todo lo que vale la pena quiere sacrificio. Exacto. Nada que fácil es lo que vale la pena. Así que eh, yo les digo, estas cosas son compensatorias en el tiempo. Ahí depende de los trabajos de ustedes también, ¿verdad? Porque eh, hay trabajos que les ofrecen mejores oportunidades dentro de los mismos trabajos cuando ya son bilingües. Sí. Entonces hay, y además de eso, qué bonito saber inglés. Bueno, algunos que, que viajan a Estados Unidos o tienen oportunidad de que irse a vivir allá, ¿verdad? No como, no como ilegal, sino que como legal. Entonces es bonito que aprendan el idioma. Por muchas razones. Yo les invito a que sigan y aprovechen el tiempo y, y este, todos digan que sí. Sí, claro que sí. Yes. Ya me siento oh, mejor. Sí. Yes, of course, teacher. Yes, of course. Yes, of course. Yes, of course. No problem. A pleasure. Ok, yeah, guys. Very happy. We're very happy. Ok, let's begin, guys. Today is the practice. Review and practice. Okay, vocabulary practice. Okay, the first is the use of could you asking for something. One of the ways to start a request is with could you based on the member any compliment phrase. Answers to requests with could you are not normally yes, I could. The expected answers are the action that are requested or short answers. For example, if you say, could you give me something for a call? Then you say, sure. And then you give some aspirin or some medicine for the call. Okay, question number two. Could you give him some pupusas? Okay, the answer is no problem. And the answer that you give him some pupusas. 
Okay, so could you is a request asking for an action. Could you please open the door? Could you please uh, open the window? And so on. Okay, beginning, we are going to do this exercise. Okay, create requests using could you. Okay, you have come my hair, spell your last name, tell me about your family, and fix my car. Okay, we are going to ask the question using could you, but also we are going to ask the question to our partners, the one that uh, spell your last name, tell me about your family, you can do it, okay? So write down the question, guys, using could you. I'm sorry, what do you say, teacher? Write down the questions using could you. I'm okay. Teacher me sacó porque se vino una tormenta horrible ahorita. Ah, de veras. Sí, está lloviendo. Y nosotros, gracias a Dios, hoy nos hemos salvado. Ay, no, yo sé, ahorita está cayendo fuera. Pero ahí va. Ok, escuchó las instrucciones, Melba. No, oh, teacher, porque como me saltó. Vaya, va a escribir las preguntas usando el could you, usando esta, ¿verdad? Con my hair, spread your last name, tell me about your family, fix, eh, fix my car. Va a escribir oh, usted las de request. Uh -huh. Bien, teacher. Teacher, eh, yes. eh, vamos a hacer la pregunta con el call you, eh, pero usando esas cuatro que nos ha puesto. Yeah. Ok.
Doy lick. Busca, me la dejo dar en esta página tal de aquí. Are you ready, guys? Yes. Yes. Are you ready, Melba? Melba? Okay, Melba is please. <laughs> okay. Rene, give me the question for the number one. But in this case, we can use those sentences or we can change. No, only one question. Okay, entonces, I'm sorry. <laughs> Okay. Then, then, could you comb my hair? Uh huh. Could you comb my hair? Tell me the number two, Sandra. Could you spell your last name? Could you spell your last name? Mm -hmm. Teacher, first. Could yes. You, pero, no, could you? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Could you? Could you? Sí. I omit it. Could you? Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, yes. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Now the number. The number three. Gabriela. Dear teacher. Gabriel, number four is you, Miguel, but number three, let me okay. see if Gabriela is available. Gabriela, number three. Hello, teacher. No, no puse mucha atención, pero creo que solo es agregar el call, you Yeah, could you, yeah. Do you tell me about your family? I repeat the complete question, please. <laughs> Tell me about your family. Yeah. Could you tell me about your family? Hey, Miguel, number four. Hey, okay, teacher. Could you fix my car? Could my you car. fix my car? Okay, could you fix my car? And when you ask questions, well, well, when you ask questions, you have to make a special intonation. For example, could you come my hair? Could you tell your last name? Could you tell me about your family? Could you fix my car? <laughs> Because is because is a, is a request, right? You are expecting an answer. You are expecting an answer, so you say, "Could you comb my hair? Could you spell your last name? Could you tell me about your family? Could you fix my car?" Okay, now we are going to practice in the class the two questions: the number two and the number three. Could you spell your last name? Could you tell me about your family? Okay. So be ready for these two, for these two answers. Uh, let me see, I'm going to ask uh, Sandra, okay, Sandra. Sandra, could you spell your last name? G. But the sure, of course, or something like that. Okay. Of course, teacher. Ah, uh, of course, of, of course, teacher. Uh huh. And then G A L B E 
C. Okay, and the second one. To you, Sandra, again. Could you tell me about your family? Yes, teacher. My family is small. Only two daughters and, and me. Um, only, no more. Okay, only, only. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, good. So you see the two questions. The two questions. Only could you spell your last name and could you tell me about your family? Okay, be ready. First, Oscar and Miguel. Okay, Oscar asked Miguel and then Miguel to Oscar. Begin, Oscar. Uh, what question, teacher? The two. Could you tell me? Uh, okay. Uh, Miguel. Miguel, ready? Ready. Okay. Could you spell your last name? R O O D R A E U A C Rodriguez. Okay, it's easy. Okay. Easy. E Sorry. Easy. E <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Okay, and then you say, Oscar, thank you. Uh, thank you, Michael. Okay, the number two. You're welcome. Question number two. Uh, could you tell me uh, something? Could about you your tell family? Me about your family? My family too. My mother. My wife. Are you married, Miguel? <laughs> Are you married? In mi modo, no, ya lo es una novia. <laughs> <laughs> Aquí por ahí tenían esperanza, verdad? Pero no, ya estuvo. Okay. <laughs> sorry, teacher, sorry. <laughs> okay, now Miguel, ask the questions to Oscar. Number two. Num yeah, number one, uh, the number two, yeah. Would you spill Spell. Spell your last name, Oscar. Sure, Michael. Um, it's a G U A D O Guido. Okay, Sally. But maybe it is, it's G U I. The O, <laughs> okay. We could you say A, I, 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 I okay, I. teacher, okay. Number two, three. Number two, uh, number three. three. That, that is number three. two. <laughs> two. Could you tell me about your family, Oscar? Sure, sure. Uh, my group family, um, are um. Three persons. Uh, now, but uh, I have um, three daughters and my wife. So um, we are uh, five members. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. To be sincere. <laughs> okay, now Rene and Jacqueline Aguilar. Okay, Rene, ask the two questions to Jacqueline and then Jacqueline to Rene. Okay, begin, Rene. Of course. Okay, Jacqueline. Are okay. you ready? Yeah. 
So, could you tell me about your family? Okay, my family is small. I have siblings. I have a sister called uh, Veronica. I have a brother called Alexander. And I live with my parents, my mom, and my daddy. And we have three dogs and have a one a cat. So we have a uh, a lot of chicken too. <laughs> and we enjoy dinner together every day. Okay, so thank you so much. You consider the so animal cool. your family, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the next question. Okay, Jacqueline. So could you tell me so could you spell your last name, please? Okay, Rene, my last name. A U U I L E A R Aguilar. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Now uh, Jacqueline welcome. ask the question to Rene. Okay, Rene, uh, could you spell your last name for me, please? Yes, a score. R as in Romeo. A mm -hmm. as in India. Uh, 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 you say last name, right? Yeah, yeah. Yes. <laughs> okay, I, I got confused. So, uh, let me see. C as in Charlie. Uh, R as in Romeo. U as in... Let me see, uniform, Z as in Zulu. Okay. Rene, but it's not that uh, your last name. Uh, yes, but it's more... <laughs> easier <laughs> to say another last name, but it's confused for me. I don't understand. <laughs> it's more common. Okay, now continue with the second one. Okay, Rene, could you tell me about your family? Okay, I'm going to tell you about my family. Uh, I live in with my, my parents, and my mom and my father, and I got uh, some, I, and I got uh, two sisters. Their names are uh, Brenda and Beatrice. Only that. Okay, thank you. Okay. Thank you. And now, Leticia, are you participating? Yes, teacher. Okay, you are gonna ask the questions to Sandra. Uh, Sandra, I already asked you, but now with the classmate, okay. Leticia, ask the questions to Sandra. Okay. Uh, Sandra, could you spell your last name? Sandra one, Sandra two, Sandra three. <laughs> out, <laughs> out. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now, Lisette, are you participating? Okay, Gabriela, okay. So ask Gabriela. <laughs> Leticia, ask Gabriela. Gabriela. Could you spell your last name? No answer, Leticia. Ah, okay. Um, es solo de letra el 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 last name, ¿verdad, teacher? Yes. Yeah, your last name. Um, P O C O. Okay, it, she finished Leticia <laughs> because it's could only you, B O Z O. It's possible. Could you tell me about your family? Um, my family <laughs> is 
Large or uh, small? Sure. Small. Ah, uh, small. Your husband. Um, I I I live alone, teacher, and. Ah. Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, I I. Okay. <laughs> Uh, I stay with my grandmother um, for work. Ah, okay. Only you live only with your grandmother. Ah, yes. Very, very small family. Okay, now uh, you, Gabriela, ask the questions to Leticia. Este, solo para mí que no tengo las preguntas a la mano. Ah, era, era, could you Spell your last name. Last name, last name. Last name. You sure? R O L I M. Okay. Could you tell me about your family? My family is small. I live with my mother. I have two older brothers. Only. Okay, thank you. Only Carlitos is missing. Carlitos, are you there? I'm driving right now, Dacia. Ah, okay. So continue with the next practice. Sorry. Okay, another way that you will use to ask for something, uh, ask for an action is using would you mind? Would you mind? If you remember, I explained that you use would you mind when you say te importaría, right? Te importaría, okay? And then you say the favor, you say the action. Okay, another way to start a request is with would you mind? ING form of the main verb. Remember when you use could you, you use the base form, but with would you mind you use the ING form. Okay, remember that. And any complement phrase. Okay, the expected answers for requests with would you mind are not usually no, I would not mind. They are answered with the actions that are requested or short answers, okay? Listen to examples. Would you mind keeping your dog inside your house? What is the request? That you keep your dog inside the house because your dog is dangerous, okay? And the answer is not a problem. Would you mind not parking your car in my place, please? What is the request? That you don't park the car in the place in the parking lot? And the answer is, of course. Pero no creo yo que esté tan contenta la persona, ¿no? porque cuando se refieren a cosas de carro, se enojan todos. Okay. Would you mind not parking your car in my place, please? Of course. Okay, now here is the exercise. Using Okay, create requests using would you mind. First, help me with my homework. Don't speak so loud. Let me 20, let me $20. Turn the lights on. Okay, guys, do this request using would you mind.
Ready, guys? Yes, teacher. Okay, who is going to tell me the number one? Yes, teacher. Tell me the number one, Oscar. Tell me number one, Oscar. Would you mind tell me with my own book? With my homework. Number two. Juan Jose. Okay. Is would you mind don't speak so low? So loud. So loud. Would you mind don't Oh, loud. Loud. <laughs> Question mark. Question number three is for Jacqueline Aguilar. Tell me number three. Okay, teacher. Would you mind lending me twenty dollars? Would you mind lend me twenty dollars? Number four is for Leticia Rolling. And turn the light, the lights on. Would you mind turn the lights on? Okay, here you have the questions. Listen. Teacher, I teacher, I say lending me because you say that when you use would you mind, you use a uh, ing I verb. Yeah, nobody told me with ing. Yes. Bien, I say I told you, would you mind lending me twenty dollars? Oh. oh but nobody said would you mind help helping help uh -huh. correct it please helping me. Yes. Oh you didn't remember, right? <laughs> helping me. Yes. Helping me with my homework. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, teacher, there yes. are uh, one answer. No, one yeah. question. Este, when use the A engine, uh, don't use to. Would you uh, mind helping me with my homework? Uh, yes. Uh, in helping, don't write to double P. P. Double no, P? No, 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 no. Okay. no, because it's consonant, vowel consonant. Wow, okay, okay, correct. The number two, Speak, speaking, tell me the complete Very question. Good, good, means. Would you mind? Don't, would you mind? Don't speaking so speaking loud. So loud. Loud. In in the second one. In the third one. Repeat, uh, who told me this? Would you mind lending me $20? 
Okay, in the number four. Tell me, tell me. Would you mind turning the lights on? Uh -huh. Turning the lights, the lights on. on. Le, ya le voy a decir a todos, nos equivocamos para que vean si estaban poniendo atención. <risa> Sí, okay. una pregunta, y teacher. así se aprende, teacher, así se le graba. Teacher, una, Realiza, una... mejor y está más atento. Yes, Oscar. Este, yo estaba pensando que sería, would you mind turning on the lights? ¿Y por qué? No, que... es, que es, es que es pregunta. Y como este... Eh, usted divide el, eh, cuando es un phrase al ver porque ese es un verbo compuesto ¿va? turn on entonces eh, usted puede dividirlo por medio del de objeto o sea el objeto podría usar un eh, object pronoun también verdad would you mind okay. turning turning them on pero en este caso no porque no se sabe de qué estamos hablando es mejor mencionar el okay. El, el objeto. Ok. Ok, gracias, Tiche. Tiche, okay. aunque no me crea, yo sí en, en aquí en lo que escribí les había puesto el ING, el, solo que me había comido el MIN y ya en la última oración lo corregí, se los agregué a todas en sí. No, sí, no, sí, yo le creo, yo le creo, claro que le creo. Pero no había visto las de la pantalla. Y yo solo como yo solo escribo lo que me escriben, lo que me dicen, chu, 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 y, en el, y en el último no, que usted lo dijo como usted dijo, no le puse atención. Sí. <risa> okay. Es que yo dudé, dudé y fui a revisar la, la presentación y vi que decía el eh, Ajá. Eh, Ajá. Very, very well, Sandra. Congratulations. Applause for Sandra. No, teacher, no era para eso, solo era que... Ok, now we are going to make that Miguel repeat this question, but listen, Miguel, listen. Ok, would you mind helping me with my homework? Ok, only listen the four, ok. Would you would mind... You mind no, no, don't... Re... Listen first, listen the first. Ok, I'm going to read the four, and then you say the four. Yes. Yes. yes Miguel. Okay. Would you mind helping me with my homework? Would you mind don't speaking so loud? Would you mind lending me $20? Would you mind turning the lights on? Okay, listen again. Would you mind helping me with my homework? Would you mind don't speaking so loud? Would you mind lending me $20? Would you mind turning the lights on? Now you, Miguel. Would you mind help, helping my wife, my, my homework? Homework. Homework. Number two. Could, would you mind don't speaking so loud? Number three. Would you mind letting me... Letting 20, me. Letting me. Twenty dollars. Number four, would you mind to turning the lights on? Okay, turn, turning, turning. Turning. Okay, but would the... Would you mind turning, turning the light on? Okay, but the intonation, Miguel, the intonation, when you ask uh, this kind of question, you raise the intonation in the last word. Usted sube la entonación en la última palabra, usted sube el, el, el estrés, o sea, el, el volumen o, o la palabra se eleva, la voz. ¿Ok? Escúcheme oh, otra vez. Oh Would you mind helping me with my homework? Would you mind don't speaking so loud? Would you mind lending me to the dollars? Would you mind turning the lights on? Ok. Again, again. 
Would you mind helping me with my homework? Would you mind doesn't don't speaking so loud? So loud. So, so loud. Would you mind lending me twenty dollars? Would you mind to turning, turning turning the light on? Turning the lights on. Okay, thank you, Miguel and the rest. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. <laughs> what did I do? Yeah, okay. Uh, okay, and the next topic that we started was the use of should. <clears throat> okay, should is for making suggestions and to give advice. You say should is deberías, right? Deberías. Okay, you should study more for the exam. Students in this level three, you should complete the platform. <laughs> you should complete the platform tonight. Okay, this is my suggestion, my advice. Example, right? Now, look, what is the... The structure you have subject should based for the member and complement. Remember the pronunciation is should, should, should. Uh -huh. You say should, should, should. Uh -huh. Very good, Miguel. Now you can do it. And then you have the example you should drink a lot of water. He should exercise every day. They should study English. Fertilize should walk more frequently. Okay, those are the examples in this is the structure. Now the exercise. Well, I explained the, the use of shouldn't. Okay, if you use should for saying that something is appropriate, and shouldn't for something that is not appropriate. Okay, it's a way to give a suggestion about something that is not appropriate. You have the subject, you have should not, or the contraction shouldn't, base form and complement. Okay, examples you have <clears throat> Pedro shouldn't, Litter on the street. Remember what is litter? Pequeño. Pequeño. <laughs> no, it's not pequeño. <laughs> Little is pequeño. Okay, litter is make pee pee. Paso okay, pura. on the street. <laughs> okay, you shouldn't litter on the street. Boys, you men. <laughs> Women, no, right? We don't do it. But men, you shouldn't. Do you understand what I mean? <laughs> como que queda con la cara así como que, que me cabra querido decir la teacher. Líder es basura, teacher. <laughs> no. No. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Eso yes, me yes, tira yes. el traductor. Sí, yes, sí, yes, sí, sí, es cierto. Acabo de ir a ver cuál era la diferencia entre el libro y el libro. Es que ella dijo el libro. Libro. Pequeño. Ajá. Va a tirar basura, yes. Pero en unos contextos lo usan así, fíjese. Bueno, libro. Eh, eh, ok. My brother shouldn't. Say mean words. What is mean words? Do you remember what I said that, that is mean words? Malas palabras, okay. Mean words. Mean words. Uh -huh. The men shouldn't use drugs. Okay, that is very easy to understand. Fast shouldn't play that bad. Are you from 
Santa Ana? No. <laughs> because if you are from Santa Ana, you are fast. Okay, fast shouldn't play that bad. Okay, something that is not a good idea to do it, you use shouldn't. Let me see. Which are the sentences, the example? Okay. We have one, two, three, four, and only that. Four. So use you, you should or shouldn't. For example, if you have we go out for dinner tonight, what you consider that it should or shouldn't? We should. Sure. Then the normal is should, right? But you can say shouldn't. Maybe it's, it's not convenient for any reason, but do it, okay? As you consider. Should. Raining should, a lot, or, fishing. Ah, because it's raining. Then you shouldn't. <laughs> okay, it's according to what you consider. So, right, should or shouldn't?
Are you ready? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Hey, Melba, tell me the number one. No, teacher, todavía no. Rene, number one. We should go out for dinner tonight. Tonight. Is it raining in your house, Rene? Yes, it is. I can listen. Okay, the number two. Give me this one. Okay. John. I am here. Uh, the number two is he shouldn't not go to the movies every day. He shouldn't. He shouldn't go to the movies. Go to the movies every day. Every day. Number three is for Lisette. Leslie. Number three. Jacqueline Aguilar. Me teacher. <laughs> okay, Miguel. She should take a nap this afternoon. Okay, number four, eh, Carlos. My dog girls shouldn't go to bed at 11. Eleven AM or PM? What do you think? PM. PM. Okay, that's it. We finish this. And uh, uh, we are going to do this because we did the, the previous, not this, right? Number five, six, seven, and eight. And that's it. What do you say is in number five? Uh, You could, could, can, you, you could, you could, or you call, should, no, call it, could, could, you could, call your brother back later. No, Miguel, no. Well, only, you, only working with should and children. You shouldn't. Uh, you shouldn't. You shouldn't call your brother back leader. Okay. Uh, it's possible that you say you shouldn't, right? Only that mm. the, your, call your, your brother, brother back leader. Back later. <clears throat> okay. Leader. Here, nothing is written in, in stones. Nothing is written on the stones. That is that but, you can change it. Uh, there is an affirmation, teacher. No, it's a question. No, it's not negative. It's no negative. Ah, okay. 
Okay, okay. The, according to the exercise, it can be in affirmative, right? But you can say it in negative too. Because if you say, you shouldn't call your brother back later because he's busy. Okay. That is possible. Okay, tell me the number six, uh, Oscar. We shouldn't, we shouldn't go for a drive today. And the number seven, Juan Jose. Okay, but in this case is is positive. You should go running at night. Ah, okay, because it's good for your health. Yes. And do you do it? Yes, every morning. But he exercises at night. But if, if you don't have time in the morning, you can do it at night. And that is a good idea. Thank in you. In the night, I take my English class. Yeah, the, that is very important too, of course. Sandra, can you give me the number eight? You should... No, sorry. Uh, your neighborhood should... Come to our party. Okay, repeat please, Sandra, because I hear one more word that is not there. Let me see. Your neighborhood should come to our party. Okay, your neighbor should. Should. Sí. That's it? Should. Yes. Shoo. 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 Come to our party. Your neighbor should come to our party. Your neighbors should come to our party. Okay, that is everything. Uh, I am not seeing some uh, okay, I'm gonna correct this. Wait a minute, please. Because I have noticed something here. Teacher, no va a pasar la asistencia. Yeah, Miguel. <laughs> Okay, so say present. Anna Leslie? Carlos? Luis? Present teacher. Gabriela Janet? Present teacher. Jacqueline Marlene Aguilar? Present teacher. Joan Ivette Lopez? Juan Jose Cornejo? Present yeah. teacher. Lisette Abigail. Lourdes yeah. Sofia. Marina Leticia. Present teacher. Melba Lorena. Present teacher. Miguel Angel. Present teacher. Mirna Lisset. Oscar Edgardo. Present teacher. Rene Alonso. Present teacher. Sandra Karina. Present teacher. Okay, I want to show you this, guys, because I have noticed that still you have problems in this pronunciation. <laughs> because suddenly you said it. Okay, remember that we use here, we use put you, right? Could you? It's like a, you pronounce like a could you? Could you? And would you? It's like a, you say. 
for you. For you. And should, like you say, should. Hey, can I say all the Say, would you, could you, would you, should, should, should. Okay, repeat, um, Oscar. Should you, would you, and should you, and should. Should, only should. Should. Hey, Miguel. Ready. Could you. Would you it should Melba? Could you could you would you could be to would you to would you would you should uh -huh. Juan Jose um, could you would you Sure. Excellent. Rene? Would you? Would you? Should you? <laughs> Only should. <laughs> Only should. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sandra? Would you? Would you? So. Gabriela? Could you, would you, should? Leticia? Could you, would you, should? Jacqueline Aguilar? Could you, would you, should? Carlos Luis? Could you, would you, should? Eh, no sé si de los que no mencioné ya, ya están participando guys porque aunque no me han puesto allí oyente pero no me han participado entonces no sé si ya están presentes me avisan por favor si ya me van a participar ok guys very easy. creen que todavía les va a costar eh, conocer esto yo creo, no, que, ya no, yo creo que esta es ya la no. super clase para que ya no se equivoquen. Se les... <ríe> me expli explicado mejor en nunca, ok. <ríe> This is the best of the best. Okay. Now we are going to go to the manual, guys. No, this is the teacher's guide. I am giving you the answers. <laughs> okay, I don't know why this appears in my. And I am. Um, okay. Este como si uno no está posicionado ahí no le aparece. Vamos a ver. Let me see, wait a minute, please. Wait a minute. Oh, yes, 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 it's here. It's here, it's here. Okay, everybody, you can participate. All of you can participate in this. Remember that you can use your computer. You you learn how to do this. You are going to find etiquette, guidelines, polite, manners, rigors, control, late homer, behavior, salutation, and subject. Okay, let's think of Oh, really? But you have to do it here. I need that you do it here, okay? Go ahead, go ahead.
Anybody else? Anybody else? Uh -huh. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Behavior, 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 yes. Behavior. No, no. En la parte de mi behavior está la manager. Control reverse. Okay, I'm going to. Etiquette is ready, right? Guidelines is ready. Uh, reverse is ready. Subject is ready. Behavior is ready. Control is ready. Manners. Ready. Salutation? No, right. Polite is ready. Late Pomer is ready, teacher. Where is Late Pomer? Um, red color. Ah, yeah, yeah. I Late Pomer. And salutation? Rotation is ready. Yeah. So you finish. <laughs> if the teacher doesn't notice salutation, I'm gonna do this. You say, Hey Carlos, you have a big hand there. <laughs> your happy face that is your great thank you for your participation here good work good job okay now let's go to the next we are not going to do this okay now we are going to go. Uh, what do you say if I do, we do it this in the way breakout? Okay, here we have the exercise three. You find the mistake. Okay, you find three mistakes in the number four. Select the most appropriate answer for the request. And the number five. Write a suggestion about the following behaviors. Okay, so you have to write a sentence using should. And then here you have in the number six, you have some phrases, for example, see you, hey, what's up, hello, mister, miss, dear friend, my best morning, best record, thanks, and so so. You are going to write the words here classifying them if you consider they are they are formal or they are informal for example what do you say see you is formal or informal yeah. 
informal teacher. Okay, so write here, see you. Okay, here you have to write, see you. And so on. Okay, and so on. Okay, guys, let's go to the recounts. Hello. Yes, Juan José. Se me trabó esto, teacher. Está en dos perfiles, ¿verdad? Ajá, eso veo. Uh -huh. Y no ha entrado en ninguno. Este, No sé si quizás, quizás le va a tocar salir y volver a entrar. Vuelvo a entrar. Vaya, está bien, ahorita, sí. ahorita. Ahora sí, teacher. Ok. Yo quiero ver. La, la dos está mala. You could be. Quiere decir could you. Uh, uh -huh. you. Could you. Ah, por favor, lo voy a anotar. Entonces tenía que ponerle informal porque no está correcto. Uh -huh. No, pero eso, eso de formal e informal entendí que es para el final, las seis. Uh -huh. Pero arriba. Ajá, para el, el del número tres, eh, la vamos a identificar. Mm -hmm. Hello, guys. I want to share for you for this that you are writing, that you are doing. Okay. The first one is that you correct the mistakes. One. Yes. Mm -hmm. And the number four is that you select the correct answer. Would you mind turning lights on? No problem. Or yes, I would. What is correct? Oh, and uh, circle the correct. Yes? Number, uh, number three. Number, is, uh, yes. Is, is, uh, would you mind or... Would you mind moving your mind. car? Okay. It's blocking mine. 
Do you find a mistake? ¿Ven aquí un error en esa número uno? No, no, en la vale. dos. Este, pero Entonces, la oye, pregunta es, could... le, vamos a poner, le vamos a poner la respuesta también o solo ver el error. Sería bueno que pusieran la oración correcta a la ah, par. Oh, oh, okay. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Ah, ok. Ustedes saben que esto, lo, si ustedes trabajan lo más ordenadamente posible y explicativamente posible, es mejor. Ok. Ok. Pero esta página sí ya la tienen, ¿verdad? Sí, ya, ya la ya. Ok. Thank you. stop chatting on the phone when we have lunch. Right. Let it be. Nobody chatting here. I could do it. Uh -huh. I could do it. Let it be. Quizás la ve. Other. Other. Ok. Vaya. Ahorita me va a ir a ver si la puedo poner. Uh -huh. Y vámonos con la otra de abajo y después lo ponemos si gusta. Es que lo que estoy viendo es el, el me crea un gran recuadro de texto. De su, de su escribir, su, escribir una sugerencia acerca de las siguientes Ajá. de los siguientes comportamientos por eso ahí Ajá. dice que Sara nunca deja de chatear en el teléfono cuando está cuando en el almuerzo Ajá, Entonces, por eso sería es la sugerencia sería Sara shouldn't Sara should stop stop sharing, sharing. Ajá. Ah, pero ella debería de no Uh -huh. ella, no debería. ella no debería no, sería solo sharing
Es como que el jefe no le gusta caminar al, al escritorio. Al escritorio. Cuando algo. Ajá. Ajá. El... Hello, hello. Juan, hello. Juan le quería preguntar y usted ya se quedó 10 minutos. ¿Sí? Ok. Eh, René. Al inicio, teacher. Como el segundo, tercero. ¿René? No, I don't. Ok, today is your day. Ok. Is <laughs> Yes, yes, Miguel. In the in the this meeting, in has a com uh, comment that your call or your talk for Miguel assistance, my angel. You say my angel to Miguel. Who me? Yes. My angel. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Miguel Angel, my angel. Oh, uh, yes. <laughs> sometimes I say my, and sometimes I say, yeah, my, because my Miguel angel? is my. Por eso, my angel. <laughs> my angel. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I say my, the Miguel is my. <laughs> Okay, no, no. <laughs> Sorry, teacher. Don't be like that, don't be like that. <laughs> it's una broma, teacher. Cinco tenemos. Bye. Este ya está. Lo que voy a hacer, Melba, le voy a hacer captura de pantalla. Mm -hmm. Se lo mando a dónde? A su, a su WhatsApp. Sí. Quiero ver si la hecho. Que diga Melba, aquí está. Melba Lorena, ¿va? Sí. para que nos quede por cualquier cosa. El primer. <laughs> Did you finish, guys? Only no, number three, teacher. <laughs> no, Vaya. no, no way. <laughs> okay, see you. Vaya, Melba, ya lo tiene en su WhatsApp.
responda, ¿qué no, pasó? Hombre, le respondo así a mi mami. What's up? El hello, Mr. and Miss. Hello, Mr. and Miss. Is formal. Their friend is formal. Best three words también. My best. ¿O cuál? Best dear friend, dear words. friend, dear friend is formal. Mm -hmm. yeah. Dear friend, yes, my best. Dear friend. Dear friend. My best, my best friend or my... Mi amigo. No tiene, entonces, ¿cómo le ponemos ahí? Pablo Schud. Pablo Schud. Schud. Schud, como yo sugería, sugerir, sugeriría que después eh, como que Pablo debería de hablar o conversar con su, su grupo, pues. Su... Mm. Pablo Schultz. Pablo Schultz. Eh, Pues sí, vamos a ver el otro que dice. Le olvidan las cosas. <ríe> Eso sí. <ríe> Finish teacher. Really? Yes. Yes. We finished. 
You are the first ones. Oh. We are the winners. Yeah, you are the winners. Pónganos el 10 ahí en la pantalla, teacher. The champions. You are the champions. You are the champions. But you only are the ones that you are you are going to know. The rest know. <laughs> we have a thing like the a little chicken. <laughs> what do you mean, Oscar? You don't list you don't see the the pictures, a little chicken. No. When when the the little chicken uh, sings, uh, we are the champion. Uh, she's a uh, uh, he's uh, and uh, it's she he is a uh, un disaster. <laughs> a disaster. <laughs> a disaster. Uh, okay, it's not it's not true that they are the champions. Uh huh. It's not uh, true. You, you don't have a, a little boy. Uh, children? Yes, I have children. Ah. I have three. When you have time, uh, sit to watch television with him or <laughs> they don't watch. They don't watch television. They ah. don't. <laughs> and in the pictures. No, no, they don't they like are, it. They are, they are not uh, little children anymore. They are not little. Ah, okay. Me too, my. Uh, I would say, nieto. I have a grandson. A grandson. My grandson have a. Uh, 15 years old and only uh, be uh, play the game ah yeah don't don't speak don't sleep <laughs> don't eat <laughs> only play all on day. the phone using the phone they only yes. use the phone yes mm -hmm, that's true Okay, see you. I'm gonna see if they was finished, guys. No está muy bien. Este aquí es bien. No, lo tengo ya. Huh? I I would like that you make it no, no. in red because here I cannot distinguish which are which are the sentences that you wrote. Sí, o sea, queremos hacer uh -huh. resaltar los t-shirts para que uh -huh. se distinga. The color red, and you are missing this the exercise six. Si no te deja ir, resalta la pregunta entonces para que no, para que quede. Pero no la puedo. Resalta la oración entonces. Porque ya ese es texto propio de la presentación. Uh -huh. Mira, te voy a ver qué le puedo hacer aquí. A color. Bueno, entonces tenemos que resaltar bien que no me da el color. ¿Y qué, ¿Y qué programa es ese? Eh, fíjese que yo lo utilizo aquí con solo con el, 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 el lapicito me voy. Tengo Adobe, con Adobe creo que lo, lo, lo trabajo. Mm. Con Adobe. Pero a veces me, me manda otra cosa como que no es compatible. Cuando le, le doy una orden, me, me manda para otras láminas. Le quiero resaltar y todo. 
Por eso resalta la, la, la oración. La oración creo que sí te deja. Ajá. Yeah, esto. Resaltar, dice allí. Solo la oración resalta. Sí, es lo uh -huh. que quiero hacer. Márquela y ahí póngale resaltar. No, como es un texto que agregaste, no te va a dejar. Resalta la oración inicial, la 1, la 2, la 3. Ah, ya te entendí. O sea, que es lo que ya está escrito. Sí, correcto. Ya, la, ya que quede libre la respuesta. Uh -huh. Este, ese si sí te deja. Uh -huh. Y la Correcto. respuesta va a quedar libre. Correcto. Did you finish in your group, Leticia? Yes, teacher, pero tengo algo mal, mala señal aquí porque está lloviendo. Uh, comenzó a llover antes ahí. Según las noticias, como que hay alerta amarilla. ¿no? ¿Cuándo, teacher, pusieron esa alerta? Mm, pues déjeme ver. Ahorita, pero es en la zona oriental, eh, yo, teacher. Ah, la zona oriental. La zona oriental es ahí por... San Miguel, eh, esos... Everybody here? Yes. Okay, guys. Um, no sé cómo comenzar a preguntar, la verdad, porque hubieron dos grupos que no compartieron. Y hubo uno que sí compartió, pero no terminó. Entonces, vamos a hacer así. Van a presentar el grupo que sí compartió, que fue el de Miguel. Pero vamos a llenar juntos el que ustedes no terminaron, porque no terminaron el 6, ¿verdad? Entonces, todos van a participar en ese. Okay. Con gusto, teacher. So, Comparto. Yes. The number three. Would you need to need the lights? No, on? the number three. 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 The exercise no, number faltó. three. You didn't do it. <laughs> Ah, eh, no ok, sal Sandra. Nos no saltamos ese teacher. Ok, Sorry. stop, stop, stop. Stop. Um, Sandra está avisando allí que ya se lo hicieron. Comparta, Sandra. Mm, no sé si pueda porque no sé. Aquí, aquí lo da. Desde el teléfono, teacher. Desde el teléfono lo está compartiendo. Sí. Pero usted puede compartir en el teléfono. Es que, teacher, yo lo tengo, eh, hago el trabajo así en el manual. Ese que lo está compartiendo es usted, Melba. Este, no, Sandra. Sandra. 
Eh, casi no se notaba. Pero yo sí lo tengo, Pichol. No lo puede. Eh, ¿Y si usted lo, lo hace más grande en el teléfono? O sea, en el Zoom. No, teacher, es que yo mi celular no lo tengo en Zoom, solo lo tengo en celular para conectarme a la tablet, entonces no puedo. No se le puede decir ampliar así. No. Ok, entonces lo vamos a hacer todos juntos. Stop yes. sharing. Stop, please. Ah, oh, no, o quizá yo lo que lo estaba compartiendo, ¿verdad? <risa> no, era... era... Ok. Era tan... Okay. Now identify the mistakes. In the number one, cuando yo le doy así, sí se hace más grande. Sí, lo veo más grande. Bye. Okay. And then, what is the mistake, right? The number one, is it correct? Yes. Okay. What is the mistake? Correct. Error. No, okay. Uh, the number one, is it correct? Yes. In the number two? It's correct. No, teacher. It's one. We, which is the, the mistake? Would you, uh, you, just you and you. Mm, here, right? Would, yes. Would you. You could. You could? No, could oh. you? Could you? You could because you? Because it's a question, right? Yeah. Could you feel Please. this purchase Or. order? Question mark? Okay, and the number three, would you send in this invitation to your assistant? Is correct? No, because, no. right, would you send in? No. Would you mind? Okay, would you mind? Send in this invitation to your assistant. Okay, the number four. We have two mistakes and there are only three. Number four, would you mind ordering something to eat? Is correct? Correct. Number five, could you come in earlier tomorrow? Is it correct? It's one teacher. Could you mind? Could you is could, could you, you mind you, the correct? Could you mind? Are you coming? sure that is the correct? Sorry. Sorry. Could you, can I say could you mind? Could you come? Aha, uh -huh, yes. That is um, it. Could you come earlier tomorrow? Okay, that is the, the... now uh, I want to stop sharing for um, Miguel to present.
Now present the rest. Hey, teacher. Okay. In the number four, you have, would you mind turning lights on? The answer is, yes, I would. Is the correct? No, no problem. No problem. It's incorrect, Miguel. <laughs> Sorry. The answer is no problem. Acuérdese de que la respuesta de ese no es un yes, I would. Ah, ah, ah. Eso no es la respuesta. Eh, por consiguiente, la, sí, la número dos tampoco. Could you order something to eat, please? Mm -hmm. pizza. Could, you, could you request more jumbo paper, please, please? Uh -huh. Right away is correct. Would you mind getting 10 copies of this report? In a minute, it's correct. Excuse me, could you turn down the volume the volume a bit? Uh, no a is no is no correct. A is the no B problem. a problem. Nice. Okay, next, next. Next. Okay, Sarah never stopped chatting on the phone when we have lunch. So you say Sarah should not continue using the phone. It should shouldn't, right? Mm, it's incorrect. Mm -hmm, it's incorrect. It's true. Eh, ok, el, el resto, por favor, ayuden a Miguel a detectar en qué es que se ha equivocado en la 1. Sara, Chu. Eat is a bad habit. El suyet. Chuden. Uh -huh. It's shouldn't, Michael. Shouldn't. Shouldn't. But is that a mistake, guys? Or the, mm. is there another? Uh, shouldn't. Shouldn't. No, es que era negativo, tío. No, sí. Uh, ellos le están dando esa corrección, pero en realidad no es esa la corrección. No, no, no. Te continúo. Ah. Ajá, ¿cuál ah, es el error el, con el, continuous? El, 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 el verbo es. Uh -huh. no. Base form. Base form. Base form. Do you use should or shouldn't you use the base form? What is the base ah, form? Continue. Continue. Ah, pues nosotros lo tenemos mal porque no mm. respondemos con show. <laughs> Sarah should not continue using the phone. Vaya, chequeme el spelling de ese y pasemos al siguiente. Ok, next. next. No, no, no el no, number two. Ah, two. <laughs> ok, my boy. Vaya, ese también tiene un error. Detéctemelo los demás, por favor. Yo my ya puedo. Boss. Aquí. My boss should to walk my desk. Ahí hay. Tú. El tú no debería de ir. Sí. Por el ese tú. Jamás un should lleva un tú. Y también la es. L se la ha puesto mal, va. Pero eso ya es. No, no, el otro no. No, solo, solo el, el show, el, después de show. Uh -huh. Sí, vaya, le voy a decir una cosa, este. Es. Eh, Miguel, eh, cuando se le da la estructura, de, se le da el, la estructura de algo, algo que se está usando, en este caso el uso del show, es como una fórmula una fórmula, si digamos usted una fórmula, por ejemplo la, yo les ponía el ejemplo del, del agua, de H2O si usted le pone a, a H3O, entonces ya es otra cosa igual sí, sucede teacher. aquí, usted tiene que seguir la fórmula, usted tiene que Excelente, seguir la estructura Thank you. 
después sigue el verbo inmediatamente, ¿verdad? Y no hay un infinitivo. Es un baseball, no un infinitivo. Vaya, en el siguiente, Jimena y Susana should not take. Ese está bien, ¿ve? Pablo should talk. Uh -huh. Graciela should not find. Ahí hay otro error en la número 5. ¿Cuál es el error, guys? Graciela eh, uh, should. El, el verbo. El verbo. ¿Qué, ¿Qué tiene el verbo que no debería llevar o debería de llevar? El ING. No, eso no Miguel, es Miguel, vamos la, a. La S. Sí. <risa> Miguel, <Sí>. otra vez. <risa> el verbo, ¿cómo va cuando se usa should? En presente. Base form. Facebook. Repáseme esa estructura, oiga. Repásela. Ok, teacher. Ok. Porque si usted está diciendo que es ING, entonces... Estoy en paz. <risa> sí. Está lo mismo, sí, ¿verdad? Que sí, no... teacher. El sí. base form. Sí. Vaya, quítele la S ahí. No puede llevar S. Porque es base form. Base form. Base form. Uh -huh. teacher. Ok, <risa> sorry. Piensa que ya nos pasamos, ya nos ah, pasamos de los así minutos. Lo vamos aprendiendo. No sé Bien. si hacemos el otro. Stop sharing, eh, Miguel. Next. No, no, no. No lo este. Stop sharing. Stop sharing. Uh. Ajá. Vaya, ya veo que solamente hay ocho. No me hay. <risa> Vaya, si quieren, este, acompáñenme los minutitos que faltan y, y se queda mañana Juan, porque miren, hace ya no está. Acompáñenme los demás y llenamos este, el último. Con Juntos. gusto, teacher. Okay, está bien, teacher. Eh, bueno, está bien, ahí teacher. le voy a poner mejor nota, oigan, a ustedes. Eso. A los que se salieron, no. Si nos hace falta un punto, ahí lo pon. Sí, Una carita yeah. alegre, teacher. Una carita alegre, teacher. Sí, una carita It's alegre. Smiling face. Vaya este. Ok, en de forma. In the formal. Hello, Mr. Miss. Hello. Ajá. Uh -huh. Your friend. Hello, Mr. Ajá. Eh, what else, sorry? Dear friend. Dear friends. Dear friend. And best regards. Dear. Best regards. Yes. Best. Best regards. The formal is is over. It's informal is see you. See you. See you. Yes. Hey. Hey. Oh, hi. Hey. I have T H M. That is thanks. What's that? What's up? There is no what's up. <laughs> eh, no, la aplicación, at. sino que es what's up. No, what's up? At. <laughs> at. Uh -huh. What's up? At. What's up? No, what's up? Morning. Uh -huh. Morning, only morning. Hey. Good morning, informal. Are you sure that it's morning in this part? Yes. No, because morning. Not, morning puede no, ser formal. No, porque no es good morning. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. 
Pareciera que es fuera, va, pero no, fíjense, porque solo está morning. Ok. Tendría que ser good morning, va. Ajá, ¿no, va? So, so. So, so. Yes. And my, be and my best. My best is formal. Is formal. Yeah. Oh. Ah, no, si no era, no era Juan el que se iba a quedar, va. Si no queda de... <ríe> se me olvidó. Quiero ver, aquí está en No, oh, mire, se me saludó. Ok. Eh, eh, hey, hey is... Informal. Informal. Okay, thank you guys for helping me and for being with me the last minutes. But don't don't leave the class. <laughs> don't leave the class yet. Y espero les voy a dar las últimas indicaciones. Recuérdense que hoy terminamos la sesión 3, ¿verdad? En la plataforma. Entonces les agradecería que los que van atrasado, que creo que no es nadie de ustedes. Bueno, sí, hay sí hay alguien aquí. <laughs> Yo ya sí. sabe, no le voy a decir quién, cada quien concientícese. Eh, pónganse al día, por favor, con la, con la plataforma, para que, como ya les he mencionado, eh, usted la puede hacer después, pero no es lo mismo. El aprendizaje no es lo mismo. Porque sí. cuando es reciente, lo que usted aprende aplica mejor el conocimiento. Ya después usted lo hace como adivinando, con tal de salir de la curva, porque se le ha acumulado. Entonces Exacto. ya no lo hace tan real. Entonces es mejor irlo haciendo así despacio y bien aprendido. ¿no? Que lo de veras usted lo sabe. No solo porque lo adivina, porque ahí la plataforma a veces da es, puede dar la pauta para ¿no? que usted adivine una respuesta. Entonces yo les invito a que lo hagan a tiempo, ¿verdad? Complementenlo. Y eh, acuérdense, hoy es la unidad, la unidad Session 3. Ok, guys, eso sería todo. Muchas gracias por acompañarme. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Have a nice night. Good night. Good night. See you Thank you, teacher. teacher. Good night. Everybody. Thank you, teacher. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Bye, Miguel. Bye, Oscar. Bye, Carlito. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night, Oscar.